The city of Murfreesboro and Rutherford County have been studying for years the issue of the Middle Point landfill reaching capacity and closing. What will solid waste look like going forward without a landfill in our county? Republic, which is the private company that manages the landfill, only recently requested to almost double the capacity of the landfill. So to say that we were surprised by the expansion of the landfill um, proposal, I think it was something that surprised us because that's not been talked about for all these years. Republic's request to expand the landfill must be approved at various levels of state and local government. The first entity to consider Republic's application was the Central Tennessee Region Solid Waste Board. Murfreesboro and Rutherford County have four representatives that are on that board. That board has to decide whether um, the expansion request is fitting with our 10-year update uh, and our, you know, sort of where the direction that we're heading. On Friday, July 9th, 2021, the board voted unanimously against the expansion of the landfill. First time I've ever in the 20 years of doing this had a, uh, a governmental meeting at six o'clock on a Friday night, but we um, all uh, went to the courthouse, the Rutherford County Courthouse, and I can't tell you how proud that I, I was of specifically Donna Barrett uh, and Darren Gore. Donna systematically went through and detailed on the things that, you know, why that, that this expansion is not consistent with the direction that we've been heading. And, I think fortunately the Central Tennessee Solid Waste Board voted that expansion request down. So now what a lot of people are asking, what's next? And the what's next is that um, disapproval is now sent to TDEC and TDEC will now rule on whether the board voted in an arbitrary or capricious way. And I think Miss Barrett went through her resolution to show why that it's not arbitrary and capricious. So those next steps are really uh, up to TDEC now. Mayor McFarland encourages citizens to contact TDEC to let them know they're not in favor of the landfill expansion. The contact person is manager of the Tennessee Division of Solid Waste Management, Mike Horsley. Phone 615-347-0615. Email mike.horsley at tn.gov. Looking at the future of a landfill free county, the City Council voted to spend $55,000 to determine the economic viability of a waste to energy project with a company called Waste Away. It takes uh, municipal solid waste and it turns it into energy that can be used for fuel for you know, different companies who are in manufacturing. And as the slide up there says, the beginning of the end for landfills and deployment of a much needed renewable and sustainable energy source. How? Uh, Wasteway plants bring in raw garbage or single stream recyclables and send out a clean, high value solid fuel. For industry and power generators, this is all accomplished in less than 30 minutes, beneficially utilizing up to 90% of the solid waste that they process. So that's only 10% that has to go to the landfill. No odors or noise, uh, all MSWs handled indoors, quickly processed. Uh, they are located in Morrison, Tennessee. You know, it's not fair for Murfreesboro or Rutherford County to take, you know, 70% outside trash and us have to deal with that not only for the next six years or six and a half years until the landfill closes, but, you know, another 25 or 30 years, because I think it's important for us all to continue to be vigilant. I think it's important for us all to be informed and uh, you know to make sure that we let uh, the state know and, and luckily we have such a good delegation of our, our state representatives and our state elected officials that have all come out uh, in opposition to this expansion but I think it's important to let TDEC and let you know anyone know where we stand as a community so I thank everyone for staying informed I uh, thank City TV 3 for making sure and doing their part to keep everyone informed and um, you know we're going to keep the fight on making sure that we do what's best for Murfreesboro and for Rutherford County.